NASA has just released some pretty shocking news that Saturn is losing its rings. This means that the beautiful ring system that has been around the planet for millions of years is slowly dissipating. If you are lucky enough to have ever looked through the eyepiece of a telescope at Saturn, you know that its rings are one of the most stunning sights in our solar system. So to hear that the rings are beginning to deteriorate at a rather alarming rate is both shocking and sad to space lovers around the globe. Yes, flat earthers, I said globe. So what is causing this? Well, it turns out that Saturn's gravity is to blame. The gravitational pull of the planet is so strong that it is gradually pulling the rings apart, causing a rain of ice particles into the ringed planet. We may need to come up with a new nickname for Saturn soon. The groundbreaking data that the Cassini spacecraft recovered as it bravely skydived into the rings of Saturn back in 2017 revealed some very interesting findings. This, along with the data from observations that Voyager 1 and 2 made decades ago, was researched by NASA scientists recently and came to the conclusion that the beautiful rings of Saturn will be gone within 300 million years or less. That may seem like a long time, but when you consider that Saturn is 4 billion years old, it's really not that long at all. Of course, you and your grandkids will still get to observe the beautiful rings, but after a few hundred million years, they will be nothing more than a distant memory. So what does this mean for Saturn? Well, not much really. The planet will still be there just without its iconic rings. The rings of planets form when bits of dust and ice come together and create a small icy moon. This moon then begins to orbit around the planet, and as it does, it gradually builds up more and more dust and ice until it becomes a ring. It's not entirely clear how this process begins, but we do know that it happens when a small moon gets too close to the planet or when two moons collide. The rings of Saturn are a great example of this. They were formed when a small moon called Phoebe got too close to the planet and was pulled apart by Saturn's gravity. Saturn isn't the only planet with rings, however, and is actually put to shame when compared with some other ring planets in our universe. The exoplanet called J1407b has a ring system that is roughly 640 times the size of Saturn. If it's a terrestrial planet, then there are high chances that this super-Earth has many active volcanoes due to its higher mass and density. I can imagine the views from this exoplanet would be amazing if you, of course, ignore the active volcanoes and thick atmospheric clouds. Strangely enough, Saturn isn't the only planet with rings in our solar system. Jupiter, Uranus, and Neptune all have rings as well. However, Saturn's are by far the most spectacular. Rings are a vital tool for understanding the history of planets because they offer evidence that collisions with moons or comets may have happened in Earth's past. The significance of these rings reminds us to look up at the night sky and be in awe of our incredible solar system. Cassini's final images of Saturn offer some of the most amazing images and insights into the ring planet that we have ever seen. The spacecraft also took a glimpse at one of Saturn's most known moons, Titan. Luckily for us, this won't be the last time we get to take a look at Saturn or its magnificent moons. Scheduled for 2029, the Titan Saturn System mission will splash down in one of Titan's methane lakes. The mission plans to study Titan's organic inventory and recover valuable information on Enceladus and Saturn's magnetosphere. And I'm sure there will be some high-quality cameras on board the spacecraft. So the next time you get a chance, take a look up at Saturn and appreciate even more than you normally would. Who knows, if you're alive in a few hundred million years, they may be gone forever. NASA has recently found an interesting object in the Kuiper Belt, which may be a missing planet from our solar system. You can watch that video here. Thanks for watching.